Hello guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. I am so excited for today's video. This has been a long time coming. I've had these pieces in my wardrobe for a little while now, but things have been going on. We are now halfway through Vlogmas. So I wanted to break it up a little bit with another haul video. So I'm very kindly working with Princess Polly for today's video. If you guys, for whatever reason, haven't heard of them, then you've been missing out is all i can say they have actually recently launched their uk website so you guys in the uk can now shop their pieces without any surprise bill at the end no custom charges i will leave the uk site link down below i'll also leave my discount code which is literally just emily loves and you can use that to get 20 percent off your princess poly order just for sizing reference i am around five foot six in a height typically between a uk size 10 and 12 in clothing um, so yeah, I hope that helps, but I'll link all these items down below anyway. So the first two pieces that I have to show you guys I've actually kind of paired together as an outfit. You might have seen these jeans in another haul I did sneak them in and I've never had so many questions on a pair of jeans So of course these are from Princess Polly. I'm gonna go over them first because I feel like they're gonna be quite popular But these are just some of the kind of like asymmetric jeans that I'm sure everyone has seen going around recently I absolutely love them. I honestly think the cut is so flattering like this little hem detail here it's really simple but i think it just adds a really nice shape to your bottom half so i'm obsessed with these they do go down into like a straight leg style as you guys will see in the trial clip but i got these in a 12 they do fit a little bit snug i won't lie so i maybe would size up in these because they are very much like a true denim they don't have too much stretch love the wash of them you guys know i love a kind of light wash or an acid wash jean obsessed literally obsessed with them and then the top that i have just really quickly paired with the jeans is this one here it's kind of like a little satin moment i thought it was kind of cute i know it's pretty summery but i wanted to use it as a bit of a layering piece so as much as this is quite a lot of skin going on if you don't feel overly comfortable with this much on show then i was going to pair it with a white blazer so i have this one here i'm going to link a very similar one down below from princess polly in the description but i just thought if you layered it with this exact outfit you've kind of just got this top peeping through especially because it is freezing cold right now we're going to need layers anyway so i thought it was a really nice way to kind of dress it up a little bit for a dinner this would literally be perfect like i'd chuck on a pair of nude heels and I'd be good to go, a really sweet little bag. I don't know, I just thought it was a really nice little stable piece to have, and obviously when spring, summer rolls back round again, I'm gonna get so much more out of this. I mean, the patterns are so cute. I literally love it. It does have a really nice detail in the back as well. It kind of all laces up. It was a little bit tricky to do up on my own, but I got there in the end. Yeah, really happy with these two first pieces. On to something a little bit more weather appropriate, like winter appropriate, I would say. I love this top. I'm just not too sure on how it's meant to sit. So I've just placed it very delicately. I think I keep buying all these teeny tiny tops, like cute crop tops. I said this in my last haul. When you're bigger chested, it's just a little bit more effort to wear things like this because you've got to be, I just stepped on something. You've got to be on guard 24 seven or your friend's got to be like, we just need to keep a watch out here, but I think it's fine. The only thing is it has these holes. So I'm not sure if it's meant to sit like lower down or higher up. I really have no idea, but I feel like I've made it work. And I think I would literally just tape all under here so it just couldn't move. I did personally pick this up in the medium to large. Obviously they have the small to medium option as well, but it has a lot of stretch to it. It's a really like easy flowing material. This is what it looks like from the back. It does have a really full back to it, which is nice. I am thinking you could probably even wear this back to front. Should we try it? Okay, so this is cute. I am now questioning whether this is the way you're meant to wear it, but I'm pretty certain it's not, but you definitely can. So I've turned it around. This is obviously now at the front of the top, and this is the back. <laughs> I am obsessed. Okay, I'm gonna be wearing it this way around. One, it's so much safer for me because I'm not gonna be falling out at all, but this looks stunning. I love an open back detail. I just think it's so nice. And I think this doesn't look, like no one would look at me and think, hun, you've got a jumper on the wrong way around. Do you know what I mean? Like it sits really nicely. It's a super nice length. It's a little bit cropped. So you still get a bit of skin there, but oh, I'm obsessed. Okay, I'm wearing it this way around. I'm sold. I need it in every color. I flipping love this. It's such a basic piece, but I just fell in love with the color of it. And now I've got it, the quality, the fit, everything is just perfect. I got this in as well, but it feels super nice and tight on. It also feels very supportive considering it is just like a little crop top. It's really holding me in. I think it's super flattering as well. Obviously I've kept it on with the jeans. I have a couple more tops to show you guys and then we'll switch to something else. But this does have a very cute little detail to it. It has these two little strings. So you could obviously tie them in the front here and then just pop it in a bow around the back to add a little bit of extra detail. Or you could literally just 
straight tight in the back if you want to. I think I would personally do a little crossover in the front here and then quickly tie it in a little bow. I know it's so basic and again they did have multiple different colours but I just love this sage green especially at this time of year. Super wintry, a little bit more festive. I really like this. It's a gorgeous material. It's kind of, it is ripped but it's also double layered so I think that's where the support is being added. Even with like some white wide leg trousers to dress it up a bit you can do so many different things with these little tops but that is what it looks like in the back with the little bow here is a full back again. I think I also love that it's long sleeve. It's like a really nice way to kind of casual down a little crop top. Okay, we're sticking with the greens. Not sure whether I feel like one of Santa's little elves or I love it. I'm really stuck. I love the shape of it. Obviously, it's really quite similar to the last top that I showed you guys. I also got this one in a medium to large. Um, like a little crossover jumper and it fits really nicely I wouldn't say it's like the most true to size I feel like the arms are quite short so I would say this is more like 12 to 14 um, so hopefully that helps but I don't know about the colour I don't know if it suits my skin tone I feel like it does and then in the camera I'm like mm, not sure maybe it's because I do look like a little elf like all I can see up there is about this big but either way if this is your colour I'm sure it's because I'm just not used to it I never see myself in brighter colours like this at all I do recommend this I think it's such a nice little top to have especially for this time of year it's so festive like that is one thing for sure and again I really love the cut of it I'm loving these deep v-necks with the little cinch details here it creates such a nice illusion to your stomach area I know I always rave about that but it is so true love the little bell sleeves as well they have little cuffs to them you can kind of cinch this as much as you want you can undo this bit here so you can just pull it down and make it more of like a fuller top and then tie this again however you want but i personally prefer it up like this as more of a little bralette style because i think it's a little bit more flattering i'm not used to seeing this color on me so let me know what you guys think does green suit me i don't know i love the sage green but i think this is a little bit maybe a bit too out there <laughs> something just very sweet and simple i did just pick up a white little crew neck sweater because i love these this time of year again for layering even if i'm just like popping out the house i'll throw on some jeans this big old coat over the top done <laughs> very easy and I feel like you can never really have enough so I found this one it just says palm springs on the front and it's in this gorgeous like really light blue kind of text I think it's so nice against the white I did get this in a small to medium I'm not sure maybe the medium to large was out of stock because I think I would have gone for a medium to large but I'm really not hating the small medium so it makes it a little bit more cropped I believe this is kind of a crop jumper anyway but if I had a bralette on I would literally just like tuck up the middle here and have it as just a really cute little crop setter like this and it also makes it sit really nicely on the back because the hem just tucks up and then it just sits on top of your jeans like that quality of this is lovely it has that really gorgeous fuzzy material inside like it feels so soft on the skin perfect little crew neck it comes up like not too high but not too low i hate nothing more than a crew neck that kind of sits here i just don't find them that flattering so yeah kind of a basic piece but you can do so much with it and i actually thought this one was really quite cute they have so many logo tees and jumpers and sweaters and hoodies so many of these ones with just the simple text on the front or some graphic tees they have loads of stuff like that so if that is up your street then definitely check it out the blue jeans are gone i have just thrown on these brown tone jeans with the palm springs top which i don't think i wouldn't style it like this i just the colors don't go but i just obviously wanted to show you guys these on these are actually from motel rocks but they sell motel on princess polly they actually sell quite a few different brands um and then obviously they have their own designs and own styles and stuff like that so you can find so much on there if you like i said at the start if you haven't heard of them honestly they are so so good for finding literally anything you can think of and like i say if they have the brands as well that you love it's perfect to have everything in one place but onto the jeans these are really nice the only thing i would say is these are in a large and they're not super snug on me but they are a little bit snug and like i say i'm usually i am a 12 in my bottom half um so that for sizing reference hopefully helps but if you are in between sizes i would say maybe go for the size up like if you're a medium i would maybe go for a large um because you can also cinch the waist in with a belt if it does get a little bit too big but I really like them. I love the colour. I've been dying to get my hands on a pair of jeans this kind of colour for ages. I love like all chocolate or nude tone outfits. I've seen so many people style these on Instagram. So I'm really happy I did finally get my hands on them. They are so soft. Like the denim of this, it honestly feels like I'm wearing joggers. Like they don't feel like jeans. They're not uncomfortable in any way. Okay, with this one, we're probably going to have to just excuse how see-through it is. I didn't realise it was 
this year so i think this one might have to wait until the beach next year in summer um because i don't know how i'm gonna make this work unless i just pair some nude underwear with it i haven't got the best choice on right now so just excuse that but the actual shirt itself is really gorgeous like i say for a beach cover-up this is going to be perfect it's like a really nice oversized kind of fit super long arms really lovely cuff details to it and it also dips in the back like the hem at the back is dipped so it gives you a really nice coverage over a bikini the girl did style it as a shirt dress literally with this belt which is why i picked up this belt which i do think is very cute i think i'm going to get some wear out of this because i do love it but yeah it didn't look too sheer on her so i've kind of tried to make it work but i feel like it doesn't really have the same effect obviously you guys will be able to see it in full from the try on clip and i think the shape of it is gorgeous like i love the way the hem dips at the back it gives you really nice coverage but then it's super short in the front which i think is quite cute i think even with like chunky lace-up boots this could be really nice for the winter time with a big coat thrown over the top but i just don't know i think i am going to save it for the beach and for the hot weather i did get this in a uk size 12 and as you can probably see it is kind of made oversized already so definitely stick true to size in this one and it will fit how you want it to i'm looking forward to summer when this can come back up the wardrobe and we can get some good use out of it a little black dress moment i couldn't not especially at this time of year when i live in little black dresses if the girls want to go for drinks those christmas parties I need a good staple in my life so this is a really gorgeous knitted one i really like it i kind of love this neckline i think it can be really flattering especially again if you do have a little bit of a bigger chest because it doesn't reveal too much but it still kind of gives you a little bit of skin showing so yeah the dress itself is gorgeous it does just tie up in the back so you can make it fit you however you want as well and it gives this really lovely open back detail again which you guys know I love by now. But yeah, the thing I liked about this dress was it came with the little arm warmers, which I know have been quite popular for a little while now. And I really liked how it casual down this, because obviously if you've had this exact outfit with just some heels, cute bag and a blazer, you've got a really nice dressed up outfit with a little black dress underneath. But I thought adding these made it a little bit different one, but I thought kind of casualed it down. So this is what it looks like with the little arm warmers. I'm kind of obsessed i've seen so many people styling dresses like this at the minute with the little hair warmers the arm warmers whatever you want to call them i like that it makes the dress look completely different like i feel like this is now a completely different outfit to what i just had on also again in the summer like this dress on its own will be perfect i'll get so much use out of it but this makes it a little bit more appropriate for this time of year again even just with some chunky boots it could look really nice one thing i would say is again i did go for this dress in a large um so maybe bear that in mind it is quite short in length you'll probably be able to see on the try-ons but i do really love it it is a very stretchy material so especially if you are like petite in height this will fit you absolutely fine because it's stretchy this is what it looks like from the back by the way with the little c's on i want to say they had it in other colors i feel like everything on their website they do have in other colors so i hope they do but i think the black is just such a staple like it's going to be very timeless this on to the final couple of items that i have to show you guys of course starting with the loungewear set you guys know i love a little tracksuit a jogger and a sweatshirt this i've seen all over their instagram for the longest time i believe they restock it like all the time because it's so popular but i see why <laughs> this is their gorgeous like cream tracksuit set that they have with the little pop of green i love this colorway i love these two colors together i don't know what it is about it but yeah this feels so nice on i got the joggers in a 12 and they are a little bit tight so don't be afraid to size up if you like a looser fit jogger but you'll see how they fit in at the full length because they're still kind of baggy on the ankle but i would say they're quite tight around my thighs and my bum area so it just literally depends how you personally want them to fit but they do have the drawstring waist of course so you can cinch them back in if you are a little bit too big but then the jumper i got in a size 14 and this actually fits really nicely it's not crazy oversized so i think it's still quite flattering like it doesn't drown me at all obviously you can pair both pieces with anything you want to as well and um, i did pick up both because i love them as a set again it's the same sort of quality as the palm springs jumper so it has the super fuzzy material on the inside really nice crew neck could not rave about this more the joggers are like my perfect style as well they are super high-waisted and they have the cuffed little ankle to them as well so yeah really really happy with this piece i'm glad that i finally got my hands on it like i said i've been seeing it on their instagram for so long now and then the final piece that i have to show you guys is a gorgeous gorgeous coat i thought i'd quickly throw it on with this tracksuit because i would probably pair these two together but oh, i just love this so much the quality is insane like this feels so so nice 
trying to figure out what size I got this in. I got this in an XL, mainly because it is like a little crop jacket. So again, depends how you guys want it to fit. But I did want it to be a little bit more of like an oversized bomber style fit. But yeah, I'm just so impressed with this. It feels so nice. These little cuffs, I love that they're a really nice little detail, but they are so thick and cozy. Honestly, this feels incredible. It feels like it could be designer. Gonna go as far as to say that. But it just feels so nice. Like, really impressed. Love the colour as well. It's obviously like a super neutral, kind of muted khaki, I would say. It does look a little bit greener than brown. So obviously you can pair it with so many things. It looks really nice with the cream that I've got on here. But even with an all-black outfit, because it does actually have black details to it. So the lining here, as you guys can see, is black. And then also... The little zips are as well so i think it'd be really nice with an all black outfit even leather trousers leather leggings things like that i don't know it's a coat there's so many things you can do with it but obviously it is freezing right now and i love love a good coat collection i do need to clear it out at some point because i need to make way for more also from what i remember off the top of my head this was not expensive at all and obviously if you use my discount code emily loves that will get you 20 percent off as well so yeah perfect time to pick up this little coat if you like the look of it so that is everything i had to show you guys i am not going to spend the rest of my day in this cute cozy tracksuit i'm actually traveling to london after i film this video so it's the perfect little traveling outfit make sure you hit subscribe if you're new here and you want to stick around for more in the future or if you're just not subscribed and you always come back to watch my videos please do click that button also give this video a thumbs up if you are enjoying the videos at the moment it really does help me out to figure out whether you guys do like the videos and also to push my videos out to a new audience so i'd be really appreciative of that um but yeah thank you so much for watching and hopefully i'll speak to you guys very soon in my next one bye guys